Hi there, my name is Pooja Rai. I am working as DSW in this group home. Uh, we are supporting four individuals in our group home right now. Today, uh, I am giving you a short orientation about the proper procedures of medication administrations uh, in our group home. I will be explaining all the procedures as well as posting the videos of me demonstrating the procedures. So if you have any concern or the question, then you can reach out to me. So at first, we have to maintain our hand hygiene. For that, we can wash our hand with soap and water or apply sanitizer in our hand. After that, we have to gather all the supplies and the materials that we need for the medication administrations. Um, so for example, we may need the pills, the medications, the medication cup, peel cutter, peel crusher, and most importantly, mark seat and the gloves if we, if we prefer. So after, uh, for example, I am giving my, uh, I am giving uh, tablet medications to my individual. So for that, I need the medications, tablet medications, the mark seat, the uh, medication cup, and the peel cutter. So after um, gathering all the materials and the supplies, now I have to verify, verify the medication in my hand with the prescriptions or the mark seat over here. So while verifying, we have to pay attention about the name of medication, dose, time, frequency, and uh, route. And most importantly, the specific instruction that we need to follow to administer this medication to my individuals, which we can found in the medications itself in here or in the mark seat over here. So after, uh, um, after verifying the things, we have to prepare our medications and we have to approach our client, our individuals in calm and respectful way we have to we have to explain the purpose of the medication they are taking right now for example if i am giving tablet metformin 500 mg to mr john then i have to explain that mr john you are you are taking this metformin tablet for your diabetes so that's 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 how we can explain the purpose of medications to our individual as well as we need to we need to explain the procedures that we're going to do and the purpose of the medication they are taking in a simple and understandable language to them so we can and we have to also make sure that our individuals take all the medications and after that, you have to return back and have to document the time dose of the medication that we just gave to our individuals. And